Hi, we are so excited that you are signed up for summer camp at Manitowish this summer. My name is Karen Stanley and I'm the summer program director here at camp. We are so excited, the snow has melted and um, all of the ice is off of the lake and so we're getting ready and gearing up for the summer. We wanted to tell you a little bit about what a typical day would be like here at Manitowish. I'm going to tell you about the in-camp experience that you will have and I'm going to pass it over to Jay a little bit later who's the Wilderness Program Director and he'll tell you a little bit about trail that every camper gets to go on. Each day in camp begins with the ringing of the bell that you just heard. The ringing of the bell is what we use to indicate when it's time to eat and when it's time to change activities. So really at camp you don't even need a watch. Each day begins at 7.30 in the morning for breakfast where we all meet together and you eat with your cabin. Towards the end of breakfast, the program staff will put on some fun skits and, um, and songs to tell you about what activities that you can do to choose for the day. So after breakfast, we all chip in for detail, which is where we help to clean up camp and clean up your cabin. After that is really where the fun begins, and at 9.15, the program area is open. We call this part in the morning coaching periods, where you have the opportunity to choose from all of the different program areas and, and decide where it is that you want to go with yourself and your friends. You can choose from sailing and canoeing and kayaking, swimming on the pier on the lake, and then you can head out into the land and do nature and arts and crafts. You can head out to do tennis, bikes, music, archery, riflery, and even horses. At 30, you get to make your second choice for the morning and choose from any of those activities again. At 11.30 is what we call free time, and you can, you can choose to read a book, you can go to free swim, play roof ball, um, or just hang out with your friends. 12.30 is lunch time, and then after lunch we have rest period. Rest period is a great time to write home to your friends. At that time you'll get your mail from your friends and your family, and read a good book. Hopefully you're re-energized for the afternoon. At around 2.15 you'll get to participate in cabin activities. You'll get to choose two more, program areas to do with your cabin. At 4.30 is another free time and then 5.30 is dinner. At dinner, at the very end, your sectionals will get up and do another song and skit to tell you about what the evening program is. And then we'll do that and, and then all campers go to bed at either 9.30 for the younger campers or 10 o'clock for the older campers. So that's a typical day in camp. I hope that that sounded like a whole lot of fun. You got to see some great things that you can possibly do this summer. I'm going to pass it off to Jay. Hi, my name is Jay Cray and I'm the Wilderness Program Director here at camp. For, for a lot of you, the wilderness trip or trail is the highlight of your whole time here. And for most of you that'll be a canoe trip, but some of the older campers you may have chosen a backpacking or a sea kayaking trip. So you'll see trips coming and going from camp all session long. When it's your turn to go on trail, you'll spend the afternoon packing all of your food and equipment at the trip's house. That night, your counselor will go over all of your clothes to make sure you have everything you need. And if you follow the packing list that was included in the what to bring list, you should be fine for trail. The next morning, you'll meet at the trip's house and you'll go over and make sure you have your water bottle, your sunscreen, and everything that you need to go on trail. And the trip's house staff and the boathouse instructors will see you off onto your trip. We learned about what a typical day is here while you're at camp, but let's go over what a typical day is on trail. So you're gonna wake up in the morning, pack up everything, eat breakfast, and canoe off to your next campsite. You might stop for lunch somewhere, you might portage from one lake to another, but when you get to that next campsite, you're gonna set up your whole camp again, uh, make dinner and play fun games around the campsite, maybe go for a swim, maybe go fishing if you have a fishing pole, and then go to sleep and continue doing that for however many days your trip is. On the last morning, what you're going to do is paddle back into camp. Everyone's going to be lined up on the trip's wall, ready to welcome you in, and you're going to be singing Break Out the Oars. If you don't know Break Out the Oars yet, don't worry, because we'll teach you throughout the session. After you get back from your trip, you'll go up to the trip's lawn, clean up all your dishes, and make sure all your packs and tents are all clean so that the next group can use it just as nice as it was when you got it. So 
I hope you're just as excited as I am to go on trail this summer. We hope that gave you a little sneak peek about what your day would be like when you're here at camp and when you're out on trail. So keep your eyes peeled for more videos to help you get ready for the summer. Thank you.